Hey, it's a blessed RN, and I'm coming to show you the difference today between day versus dose. Okay, order. Drug C, 15 milligrams per kilogram per day. By mouth in two divided doses, the child weighs 70 pounds. Available is 250 milligrams per five milliliters. How many milliliters will be administered per day? And how many milliliters will be administered per dose? So this is a two-part question. Let's start with the per day. So our goal is going to be milliliters per day. So that means that we want to end up with milliliters on the top, and day on the bottom in our puzzle, right? So we'll need the patient's weight, which is 70 pounds. We'll need the prescription, which is 15 milligrams per kilogram per day. And then the last thing that we'll need for our puzzle piece is 250 milligrams per five milliliters. So if we look at the goal, we have day at the bottom, right? And you see in our puzzle piece, we have day at the bottom, right? So therefore, we do not need to know how many doses are in the day. It is considered fluff when trying to find the day and you have the day in your ordered amount. So we'll start with what we're looking for, our milliliters on the top. So five milliliters over 250 milligrams. We have milligrams on the bottom. So I'll put my puzzle piece with the 15 milligrams on the top so that my milligrams will cancel out. Okay, so now you see we have both those puzzle pieces used and we have milliliter on the top, boom, and day on the bottom, boom, just like the goal. So the only thing left is the kilograms. So I'll do a kilogram to pound conversion because my patient's weight is in pounds. So one kilogram is 2.2 pounds. My kilograms cancel out and now I'll put my 70 pounds on the top over one because it's just by itself and my pounds cancels out and now we can do the math we'll multiply across the top multiply across the bottom get a number for the top which would be 5250 and then on the bottom is 550 divide the top by the bottom and this will give us the answer of 9.54 milliliters per day and if they ask you to round to the nearest tenth it'll be 9.5 mls per day okay so now let us figure out the milliliter per dose so goal is ml on the top dose on the bottom so our same puzzle pieces will apply the patient's weight so 70 pounds our prescription is 15 milligrams per kilogram per day and then our product, which is our medicine, is 250 milligrams per five milliliters. So we're going to look at something. If the goal has dose in it and your order has day in it, we need puzzle pieces to cancel out day and dose. So we need to know how many doses are in the day. There are two divided doses in the day. So that'll be another puzzle piece. One day has two doses in it, okay? So now we can set up our puzzle, starting with our milliliters on the top once more. Five milliliters over 250 milligrams times our 15 milligrams per kilogram per day so that our milligrams will cancel out. Then our kilogram to pound conversion. So one kilogram is 2.2 pounds. Now our kilograms cancels out and we'll put our 70 pounds on the top over one. It's by itself. That's why that one's there. Pounds cancels out and the last piece would be one day over two doses and your days cancels out and you are left with milliliter on the top and dose on the bottom just like the goal wanted. So this time we'll multiply across the top, get a number, multiply across the bottom, get a number, divide the top by the bottom. So that's 5,250 divided by whatever 250 times 2.2 2 times two is, which would be 1,100, okay? So do the math and then we'll end up with our answer. 4.77 and if we rounded it to the nearest tenth place it'll be 4.8 milliliters per dose you can defeat dosage too join my live sessions for more in-depth breakdown and if you are looking for some more practice then make sure you cop my workbook
ebook and spiral bound and check out these other videos. All right. Y'all be blessed.